Welcome to Kutenda's Internet Marketing Daily Quick Tip. Today is Monday, and that means it's website day. So today's quick tip comes from the question, how does your business website turn visitors into leads or customers? When somebody comes to your website, can they turn into a lead or customer? How do they do that? And that's the tip of the day. Go out and evaluate your website's current conversion points and look for areas of improvement. So first big question, what are conversion points? What am I talking about? Well, conversion points are the opportunities on your website for your visitors to turn into leads, sales, and subscribers. So all the points on your website where you're gonna start doing business with somebody or actually do business with somebody. Why are conversion points so important? By having conversion points on your website, you're gonna be able to gauge the effectiveness of your marketing. When somebody converts, that can feed back into your marketing, you can see what's working and what's not. You can also increase the subscribers to your communication. So if you have a newsletter or some sort of uh, sales emails going out, you're gonna be able to get them in and convert them through a form. Also, you can build your list of leads, so you can build up the people that may have not purchased from you but are looking to purchase and are interested. And it's going to increase your sales, of course, by letting you convert someone and take them not just to becoming a lead but all the way to a sale. It's also going to give your visitors what they're looking for. Uh, just like in sales, you don't want to be afraid of trying to close or convert someone on your website. If you have a business website, people understand that you're trying to get business from it. So by having visible conversion points, you're going to be giving people what they expect to be there and a lot of times what they want if they're looking at your website. So five questions to to evaluate the conversion points you currently have on your site. Number one, what are my website's conversion points? Go through your pages and look for any place where you're collecting information or you're giving the visitor to your website an opportunity to give you information or make a purchase. It could be phone numbers, emails, forms on your website, or purchasing funnels that you may have. Question number two, are my conversion points easily found? When I look at somebody's website, I wanna be able to see where those conversion points are. They should stand out. So look on your website and see if these conversion points are visible. Question number three, what level of commitment do your conversion points require? Can people only purchase something? If you have a product that costs $500, that's a pretty high commitment from the website. So maybe you wanna put lower level conversion points on the site. You should also ask yourself, am I using calls to action to encourage people to convert? The text on your website should be telling people how they can convert and why they should convert. So make sure that you're using calls to action, really pointing out why and how people can convert. And question number five, when a visitor wants to convert, is the process as simple as it can possibly be? You don't want to make it difficult for someone to convert. If they have to come and fill out a form and you're going to ask them a bunch of questions that are, you know, nice to haves but not necessary, you're going to reduce the amount of people that are filling out that conversion form. So find areas to improve. Your conversion points should always be visible and available on every page. All the pages on your site should give people the opportunity to convert. You should have low commitment options and high commitment options. Don't try to sell everyone if you have an expensive product. Try to get them to come in, give you some lead information, and you can follow up with your normal sales process. Also, make sure you're referencing those conversion points in your website text and ask for only required information. Don't overwhelm. And finally, make sure your conversion points are easy to understand and easy to complete. If somebody can't figure out how to convert on your site, you have a big problem. So today's goal, go out and evaluate your website's conversion points and make improvements. Look through the tips that we just gave you, think about it, and try to find ways to make your website convert better. That's Kutenda's Internet Marketing Daily Quick Tip. Tomorrow is Tuesday, so we're going to talk about search engine optimization. And if you haven't had a chance to already, please go to kutenda.com and check out our tools and training. Kutenda is online marketing simplified. We help small and local businesses build and manage websites, do on-page search engine optimization, build and manage paid search accounts, also do local search engine marketing, email marketing, including autoresponders, and we give you all the training that you need that even if you're a beginner and you've never touched this stuff before, you'll be able to learn how to do it and apply it to your business. So check us out, kutenda.com. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow and have a great day.